hello there I am here once again with another video today I am going to show you how to use your Android smartphone as uh, an uh, external wireless speaker okay uh, to use this you have to connect your uh, laptop or your PC to your uh, mobile phone hotspot if the hotspot is not connected uh, you are not able to use your android device as wireless speaker or uh, both your smartphone and your uh, pc or laptop may be connected in the same network okay if you face any problem related uh, to the connectivity and you are not able to connect please tell me in the comment section i will help you and uh, uh, this method uh, this method i'm going to tell you works perfectly fine in any type of system it's very easy to implement to implement this method you have to download a software in your computer and one application from play store in your mobile device okay uh, first we download the software in the computer open the browser and search for sound wire sound wire uh, here you can see the second link georgia labs this is the official link for the download the sound wire server okay open it in this page you can see all the documentation and the details about the software you can read it uh, for the further information and your clearance clearance about the software what this software actually do and how it works okay here you can see this software is available for Windows 7, 8 and 10 and for older versions of Windows like XP and uh, for uh, Linux all types of Linux it will support any distribution 32-bit uh, and 64-bit okay and this is also supported the Raspberry Pi devices okay uh, now I am uh, using Windows 10 and uh, the demonstration I will show is on the Windows 10 so I download this type of version with our Windows 10 Now this software is a very light weight software okay no additional hardware requirements uh, this download button click download and save it it's downloaded click to install confirm it it's installing pretty simple steps like any software install next next create desktop icon next next and this is installed the checkbox is checked launch soundwire server and click finish here you can see the software is installed and the uh, inst the soundwire server is started but you can see this pop up this warning you can see is telling the audio device is set to sample rate 18000 which may reduce the sound quality for typical sound audio source okay here is the warning to overcome or or uh, clear this warning you have to do some settings here you can see control panel and set the sample rate to the uh, 44100 okay therefore we first open the audio device from the control panel and uh, for the speaker in the advanced tab we change the output frequency okay here according to the software recommendation I use this 24 bits 1400 Hertz studio quality okay this is the recommended recommended output frequency and apply device is in use 
okay so we forcefully click the yes and reload it okay okay and click okay okay and click it to the to close and again open it sound wire server okay now you can see uh, we don't receive any warning now see some of the features provided by this uh, application here you can see this first field the first field is server address uh, this is the IP address this is the IP address of your device okay and the current status is disconnected because uh, we have not connected any uh, our uh, device like Android device yet so the status is disconnected okay minimize to uh, this is this list uh, show what to do when this minimize button is pressed it's saying tray when you minimize it's here okay in the tray taskbar now we minimize it's remain in the taskbar okay you can uh, use it according your requirement and input select uh, here you can select which type of input you want to use your mobile device like default device it uh, use uh, as a, your android device as a speaker you can also use your uh, device like Android as a microphone okay I use the default device uh, here is the volume controller mute checkbox and uh, level here you see the bars when the uh, audio is connected uh, okay and here's the recording button when you use your Android phone as a microphone uh, you can record the audio using these buttons record and stop okay now I will uh, switch to my Android device and uh, show what you to do okay wait a second I switch to my device okay I'm here now open the Play Store and uh, uh, search for sound wire okay for sound wire server or simply sound wire now in the search result you can see the two types of sound wire software is listed one is the free and other is the paid you not uh, no need to worry about the paid or the free you can uh, simply use the free version okay download the free version and install Here you can see the uh, sound wire free version is installed and uh, now open it open it and this is the interface for the mobile application okay here all the options and the settings are listed uh, this square this is square is the button to connect or disconnect okay now in this field server field uh, here you can see auto locate click it and enter the IP address the server address uh, which is listed in your uh, computers uh, sound wire server okay and uh, one thing I have to told when you want to connect your Android device as uh, the external speaker via hotspot on the both device the sound wire server software must be in the running state okay in your now I enter the IP address 192.168.43.98 and click done and here you can see uh, this uh, status in the uh, PC application uh, there is a green connected text is there okay and in the mobile you can see this button uh, of this uh, connection is glowing okay now our device is connected uh, to the PC and uh, you can check it by playing some audio okay 
like I will open the YouTube and show you. Like uh, I will play this song. You can easily hear. You can hear the sound by this mobile speaker. And uh, and one thing uh, I want to tell you that if you uh, watch the videos uh, using this software uh, and uh, using your mobile device as the audio device to hear the audio, you will uh, face some uh, uh, latency or the delay in the voice. Okay. Uh, to solve this problem, uh, you have to do some settings in the mobile soundwire application. Open the settings in the soundwire application in the mobile. Here you can see the settings about uh, audio buffer size. This setting, okay? This setting, audio buffer size. Click it and uh, set the buffer size to the minimum. Here you can see minimum is the 8K. Minimum is the 8K. Select it and set the buffer for the 8k now back now the device is connected and you can enjoy the audio from your mobile device and uh, I also tell you you can use this uh, trick uh, if your if your uh, PC uh, does not have uh, uh, Bluetooth uh, and uh, you want to connect your Bluetooth uh, headphones uh, to your PC then, then you can use this trick and you can connect uh, your Bluetooth headphones to your phone and connect your phone uh, to your PC using the soundbar server. Therefore, you can use your uh, Bluetooth headsets and hear the audio from a PC direct to your Bluetooth uh, headset. Like uh, uh, there are two persons and uh, they, they cannot uh, easily communicate. One mediator come between them and provide an interface to communicate the first and the second person like your uh, bluetooth headphone is at one side and your pc is one side and in between your mobile device come and uh, act like a uh, uh, mediator to help the both communicating device and you can uh, generate lots of other options how to use these tricks and enjoy uh, the wireless experience of audio devices okay thanks for watching and uh, uh, I like if you uh, share this video to your friends because uh, they can uh, uh, take the advantage of this software because uh, it's free and uh, uh, not uh, required any uh, other hardware requirement anyone can use in any device okay thank you see in the another video